We get asked this a lot. Should I charge my electric vehicle from my solar panels or from the stored electricity in my battery? Well, while it's a nice idea, it's not actually the most economical use of the electricity. If you do want to find out how to charge your EV from solar, watch the video linked at the top of the screen. Now, the reason not to charge your car from your solar or battery system is that unlike a lot of the appliances in your house, you actually have control over when you charge the car. With your fridge, lights, smoke alarms, etc., they're always on and you can't set them to only be powered from off-peak electricity. Whereas with a car, you can set it to only charge off-peak. This is important because on certain tariffs, such as Octopus Intelligent Go, the off-peak import rate is seven pence per kilowatt hour. You can then sign up for the Octopus outgoing fixed export rate, which will pay you 15 pence per kilowatt hour for anything that you export. It's worth noting that this is accurate to Reading postcodes as of July 2024. So it's actually better to export solar generation than to feed it into the car. You can export it and make 15 pence and then buy it back off peak to charge the car for seven pence overnight. Now it's essential to note that you must be on Octopus Intelligent Go in order to do this, which means that you'll need to get yourself a smart EV charger such as a Zappi. If you're only on standard Octopus Go, then you can't get on Octopus Outgoing Fixed. You can only get on Outgoing Fixed Lite, which will only pay you 8 pence per kilowatt hour for export instead of 15 pence. Another issue when trying to charge your car with your home battery is that the car battery is just so much bigger than your home battery. A car battery is actually usually five or six times the size of a home battery. Unless maybe if you have a smaller battery, for example, in a hybrid car, then you could potentially charge it from your home battery, especially if you only do a few miles a day and can trickle charge the car. It's also really worth noting that it's far more green to charge your car from solar. So if you want to reduce your carbon footprint, then that's certainly the way to do it. But in conclusion, it's more economical to just charge the car battery at night and use your home battery and your solar system to power the house during the day and then export any excess generation that you have left over for 15 pence per kilowatt hour.